Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Risk of Rain 2 modded. We are jumping in once again. This time I'm going to play as the Huntress just because I enjoy the Huntress a lot. We're going with the um, Fusillade here, the No Auto Aim and Piercing, along with the Explosive Arrow and the um, Bal Ballista. That's what it's called. Anyways, I, I apologise that I missed last week's episode. I realise a few of you were probably waiting on it. But unfortunately, sometimes... Um, oh, that is very nice. Sometimes just things come about and I don't quite get the time to record that I'd like um, and that's exactly what happened, so apologies. But yeah, so no auto aim, but we do more damage, so as you can see here, we just, it won't curve our shots towards enemies at all anymore. So we do actually have to be a little more accurate than we would otherwise with this character, but that's not a big problem, we can manage that. Um, I've also got the regular dash teleport on because I kind of prefer that to be honest. It's got a bit of verticality to it and stuff. Anyways, we've got a shop off the bat, and I will definitely take the roll of uh, roll of coins, roll of pennies. That's what it's called, right off the bat. Yes, the fact that this pierces as well is so good, and it's got that nice chunky range on it too, which you don't otherwise get. Get that explosive shot going on. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, that's gonna be good. This thing with fire rate. I can see being very, very good. But I, I really like the idea of uh, not having that auto aim. It seems like a lot of fun, a bit more of a challenge. And it rewards you with that extra damage that you get as well. Uh, we'll go for an active here and then we'll go for that other item. Yeah, Shrine of the Mountain off the bat is so, so nice as well. Right, so let's get the active here and hope it's something actually worthwhile. Um, take a photo of an enemy and spawn them as an ally again. Oh, that's kind of interesting. Kind of a cool idea. A little bit unique. Um, I I'll wait for an elite enemy to come along, I think. Looks like our teleport is just here. Uh, the looks of all the particles we got going on. We should probably just go and discover it. There you go. So we remember where it is. So this guy here will take a photo of you. And then if we use this again. Okay. Okay, no, there you go. It did not copy the elite status though. Okay, good to know. Oh no, it did, it did, it did. Okay, it just isn't visually an elite, but it did actually keep the elite status. Rose Buckler, perfectly fine by me, especially with this character being able to sprint and fire. We also get the bow, um, it's fine. Reduce damage for a little while. Ooh, maybe maybe we'll take the uh, the healing guy. I'm trying to kill my own dude right now. Here we go. Oh wait, can we get multiple friends? It looks like we can. Intriguing. Intriguing. I like this. This, this could be a fun item. Right, let's go and look around a little more. There you go. Ooh, is that a big chest? It is. Oh, nice. I like the bands. The bands are usually pretty good, especially if you can stack them a little bit. Let's look at that chest back there we didn't get before as well. Another roll of pennies. If we get a fire base enemy. So we can get a little army going. Oh god, that was really dumb of me. Oh well. It's fine. So we can get a little bit of an army going. I didn't realise... I, I didn't, like, really think... That the game would let me uh, have multiple. Okay. Any chests we've missed? Seems like you can camera them from a pretty decent distance as well. I think that's what that icon is, because that's definitely new to me. We are lovely. Back through this way, we had a few chests over here. Oh, we have a terminal shop up here as well. 3D printer for backup magazine. Is backup magazine my, um... Oh, no, that's not backup magazine. Doesn't matter. My bad. Uh, da -da -da -da. The apple's actually pretty good. Increase health and rege regeneration. The next 20 minutes is just, like, a pretty long time. It's pretty worthwhile, in my opinion. Hey, there you go. Okay, and honestly, the bonus that you get from it is pretty hefty. Certainly not upset about that. Can't believe I missed this chest. Okay, crits are obviously going to be pretty good here too. 
sticky bomb. Uh, oh, just having one of them is probably not going to be super beneficial. But I shall take regardless. Of course, we do have two of these guys. Oh, the band. The band's going hard. One of them's almost dead. You're dead, good. Let's take some photos here. I still don't know if that ice one's gonna copy because visually it doesn't, but it did with the other guy, so I'm gonna hopefully assume. This guy's about to go critical. Okay, that explosive nades is so good. Yeah, we got our two items and we get attack faster at low HP times two. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. That's pretty decent. We're almost ready for the next stage already. Good, good. I'll have one of you, why not? Oh, what the hell? You came out looking a very different colour, my good guy. Not quite sure what that's about, but maybe that's just what the camera ones look like. Okay, good to go. Again, have my pineapple passion drink with me today. I thought I was recording Isaac the other day. I bought another one today. It was, it was very good, so I decided to go again. Oh, I was like, please let me take a photo of the pot and summon it. That would be hilarious, but the game says no. Go, my fierce friend. In fact, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Damn it, I should have left that guy alive and set myself on fire a little bit. Can you set me on fire? No. Darn it. Should have set myself on fire to get myself a bit of early money. It's a little silly. He's going crazy, this guy. Ooh, 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 ooh. Don't, don't kill that. I want one. There you go. Look at that. Beautiful. I very much like that. Right, back over this way because we've got a few things to buy. Chest off here to start. I remember you could teleport through that gate before. I wonder if you can still do that. Oh, crowbar. Really, really good for us here. I think the bag's pretty good, is it not? Is it not? Again, uh, short attack speed after activate. Yeah, that's decent enough. It's not perfect, but it'll help. And then here, I think crowbar. Uh, not crowbar, whatever this is called. Random boost when entering danger. That's also decent. It's not perfect, but it'll do. 60 for a chest. I have to hold off a minute here. I need to remember that this guy's my friend. It'd be nice if he kind of glowed a little bit, like had an outline. I think it'd be a little easier to spot who's mine. So the arrows are pretty faint, especially in a yellow background. Increase health regen. Lovely. Um, get another one of you. There's that attack speed bonus. Okay, we do have quite the little army here. Any other chests around this area, though? Didn't really have a thorough look, look around. There you go, that's one. Gimme, gimme. Ooh, killing an enemy restores a small portion of shield. We don't have any shield right now, but that's kind of interesting for later on. Not had an item like that before. And then, ugh, good old Bustling Fungus. Bustling Fungus is one of those things now where it's like, it's pretty bad, but at least it can be corrupted into something good. I see you there, Invisible Enemy. I don't think you can trick me. Yaw. 
Oh, there we go. That's the sort of stuff we're looking for. Lens makers is going to make everything all right. Also, our little dude is healing, which is awesome. The elite effects are working as I thought they would. Gasoline is pretty fun. This guy's invisible. Don't think that'll help as much, but it's something. I'm, I'll take the sprint faster here. Good. Yeah, we've got a nice build going now, I think. It's all coming together. Get us a few more crowbars and we'll really be in the money. Gain armor for every nearby enemy. I'm guessing that's what that circle is that just appeared around us. Get a boost in speed, I like that. Can't still apply fairy on hit, that's fine. Okay, I need a little bit more money for that. Okay, all of these guys are mine. It's good that we have um, all the all, all, all like the list of who we've got on the side and it tells us what elites they are and stuff. Pretty useful. Rockets is fine by me. Right, let's head our way back now. Oh, it's here. Why is the teleport always here on this stage? I swear it's never not right here. That attack speed bonus is pretty lovely. As we get to lower HP, yeah, you really notice it. I right, am doing a good job. Get a jetpack here. Jump height, reduce gravity. Hopefully we get the uh, weird combo for flying again. That was pretty good. Darn you, fool. Stay back, demon. I'm trying to like throw down as many of them as I can, so I've just got this absolute crazy big army. They don't seem to be dying either, which is nice. I wonder if with sh uh, Shard of Glass, um, you get like really crazy fire rate bonuses with this. That'd be really interesting to see, actually. We should try and pull that off. These guys are, are all going to disappear on the next stage, unfortunately, but it's been fun hanging out with you all. Nice. Right, ready to go. Good, good. Okay, we're getting through the stages reasonably quick right now. I've got a build that I can heavily respect. Ooh, I've been to this stage in ages. It's nice to be back to me, sir. Okay, this guy I'm gonna let hit me a little bit. Come over here, you. Please hit me. Dude, please hit me. You wouldn't mind hitting me, good sir? Guy does not seem interested in hitting me whatsoever. A little bit more. There you go. That, that'll do. That'll do. That'll do. Hey, I love that. I love that. The steady mug is really good. And nice. Good amount of money to start this off. That fire damage really helps. I'm trying to leave you alive for now. I don't know what this is. I'm going to take it. 
You're gonna race slightly faster. There you go. That's all I wanted to keep you alive for. Now you're worthy to die. I just wanted one, one of you for my very own. I wanted to adopt. I thought having one of you as a friend would be very, very beneficial to me. It seems like I was very correct in that assumption. We do get an encrusted key. Not particularly good. Oh god, hitting this thing without auto aim is pretty tricky. I finally got it. The hell are you? Are you just an invisible one of those? Okay, I think it was just an invisible one of those turrets. Right, I'm sure there's plenty for us to grab on this stage. Do you know what? I'll keep one of you. And let me get the hell out of here. Discover this just to remember where it is. That lower gravity with the jumping is very, very nice. Ooh, hello. That's really good. That is really, really good. Eh. I kind of like my uh, my wildlife camera a little more right now, I'll be honest. Mimics. More pennies. I like that. Good. Goat hoof is really nice. There you go. Get a bit of money off that guy. Get the evolving thing. I like this. Get one of them. I think we've seen pretty much everything on here. Just need this chest. Move faster when you using your utility. Okay. Decent. That's a fire and mortar. Never really interested in that one, but we'll take it. Not quite sure what this does. Close range attacks reach farther and deal slightly more damage. That's fine. Yes, threat up attack speed increase is lovely. Right, I think we're pretty much out of chests from what I can see. Get another one of them going. Let's go check on the underground bit now. Another active. That is a good active, but I'm still really liking a camera. Okay, it's looking like we're pretty much out of chests now. Oh, let's head our way. That's really good, the mocker. Head back towards the, uh, the actual boss now. And skedaddle, skadoodle. Okay, there is definitely two of these guys. I accidentally hit all my shots into the second one, despite not meaning to, but... I'm not going to complain. Okay, unfortunately it is doing his healy bullshit, but we might be able to fight through it. Yeah, we can. Nice one. Okay. Really not too bad on the bosses right now. Bosses aren't really putting too much of a fight. Doing his healy bullshit again, but again we can probably fight through it. There's not enough enemies around him for it to him to heal off of. So easy kill. And we get ourselves Elite Monsters have a chance to drop items. I like that a lot. There's a few items to do that in our mod pack, I think. I wonder what the chances are. And I wonder how many items I'll accidentally miss because I'm not looking. That fire rate, bro, this is nutty. Just 
try to keep an eye out when I kill elites and see what happens. Okay, good to go. Oh, we found a chest just here. No, I missed this chest. How'd I miss that? You can never fully clear out a stage. There's always going to be one somewhere you don't expect. Good. Got a wandering vagrant about. Do it super nerve in a second. Oh, it's dead. Don't matter. It don't have the chance. Yup. Damn it. Completely missed that. Bugged that up. See you there. Right, get back up here. Ah, oh, will be missed it again. Ret um, return some damage to sender. Nice. Okay. I don't know what this is, but I want it. Deal more damage the further away you're at. Okay, that's really good. That's the sort of shit we're looking for. Okay, alloy worship unit has been spawned. Oh, bollocks. I did not realize how much damage I was going to take off that fall. Luckily this healing thing was here. I wish we were just uh, stole that from my own. Can I steal these guys? I can! Awesome! God damn, I worship unit. You have a lot of HP. Pretty good, I like that. I like that quite a lot. Get back in my Healy circle. At least I'm getting a lot of money from taking all this damage. All proving to be a little bit much though, I've got to admit. But he is dead, and we can get our legendary. Every 30 seconds, summon a blind vermin with intense, uh, within 10, with 10 common or uncommon items. I see. Okay. Okay, that seems. Interesting. But it depends on the items it gets to how good it is. Give me all the balls. I want your balls. Right, let's actually start looking for some chests now. Barrier decay. We've had a situation with that before. It's pretty good. Take whatever this is. I'm not what I just got. Stomp. Stops to uh, barrier decay. Okay, we got some more barrier stuff. Whoa. The storm has uh, caused some darkness. Chance to shoot temporary echoes of projectiles. Temporal echoes of projectiles. Upstairs in months. Interesting. 
cool corrupted item, I see. Right, there's got to be way more chests about that I've missed. Razor wire. There's another one of these shrines, what the heck? Oh, so here's, here's one of the blind vermin with all these items, I see. I don't know how useful that's going to be. It doesn't seem great, but it doesn't seem awful either. What's this? Oh, that's my encrusted key thing. Um, What the fuck just killed me? very unexpected. I was like, oh, I could take some damage, don't worry about it. But I get absolutely stomped, damn it. Anyways, we'll leave it there. That was a fun episode nonetheless. Unexpected death though. I hope you guys enjoyed nonetheless and I'll see you guys in the next one.